Hi friends, Jenny here again, and today we're going to look at the book that we saw in this morning's gathering. And this is another wordless picture book, and it's called Wave by Susie Lee. And today we started talking about the beach and what we like about the beach and how we like the water and splashing in the water. So I thought this was a perfect book to share again so you could look a little closer this time. So on this title page where it says Wave and the author Susie Lee, it also shows the mom and the little girl coming down to the beach. What do we see on the first page? She's looking at the ocean. She looks excited. Uh-oh, now what's happening? Do you see the birds moving away? Do you see her face looks a little nervous? Do you see the water coming towards her toes? Do you run away when the water's coming near you? Sometimes we feel nervous. Oh, now she's moved away and she feels a little bit more brave. What is she doing to the water? Yeah, I think she's trying to scare it back. She's roaring. The birds are coming closer again as the water moves away. She's saying, I'm brave. So she's watching. She sees the waves rolling in and splashing, and she's watching just like the birds. Hmm. Now what? She looks curious, and she looks like she doesn't want the water to go back. Ooh, she wants to come a little closer to explore. Do you see her toe? Getting very close to the wave. She might dip her toe in, let's see. Oh my, she decided to go in. What is she doing now? She looks happy. I see her feet kicking and splashing. I see the birds flying above her. Now she's in the water and splashing with her feet. Ooh, what happened now? She didn't run away. She got a little further in and she's really enjoying splashing. Do you enjoy splashing in the waves? I do. It's fun to splash where it's shallow. But when we walk out a little farther, we might see some very big waves. Hmm, she looks a little nervous. What do you do when you see a big wave coming near you? Yeah, she's running. She's running back to where she knows the wave won't get her. So she's moving back up on the sand. And she's saying, ha ha, you can't get me. She's sticking her tongue out at the waves saying, Pfft. hmm, but how high is that wave going? And where might it land? Let's find out. Oh my, big splash. I hope she's okay under there. Let's see. <laughs> She's okay, but she got really wet. That wave did catch her, after all. But once she's wet and the wave came a little higher on the sand, look what she's finding. I'll hold it closer so you can see. Tiny shells. Ooh, a new discovery. Do you ever discover interesting things in the sand while you're at the beach? <gasps> She's found some treasures, some seashell treasures. Who do you think she's showing her treasures to? 
who do you like to show your treasures to? Probably her parents or her family. And who's here looking ready to go? I see her mommy has everything packed up, but she is still enjoying the feeling of the sand and the water on her hands, exploring for what's just underneath the sand. And she knows it's time to go. So what's she doing? She's leaving with mom, but not without saying, goodbye ocean, goodbye beach, goodbye waves, goodbye sand, goodbye seagulls and seashells. The end. I hope you have a chance to get to the beach this summer or maybe splash in your pool or maybe grandma and grandpa's pool. I hope you enjoyed this story and we'll read together again soon. Bye friends.